No movement yet. No it's movement. Cold out here. Oh, oh, oh! Here, here we go. Here we go. Nico, Holy! Sit. sit, dude. That thing's ripping. Come here, Nico. Oh my God! It's ripping, bro. It is ripping. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to NB Edits. Thanks for joining me today, guys. Tonight, I am out here grinding. We are doing some walleye ice fishing. I've got multiple tip-ups that I'm gonna be setting up here tonight. I've got three of my own, and my good buddy Jordan is with me with his little pup, Nico. He's gonna be setting up three of his own as well. Hopefully, we get on top of some fish. Now, the goal for today is to go ahead and chase a giant as always but I would like to get into some small ones so we got a couple eaters the slot here is the fish have to be over 15 inches to keep and you can't keep anything between the inches of 20 and 24 the reason for that is you want to be able to keep those mid-sized walleyes especially the females uh, alive and ready to spawn for next year so we're gonna go ahead get our stuff all set up, start drilling up some holes. It's a little chilly out here, so we might be sitting in the truck for some of the meantime tonight, but uh, Jordan was just out at this location uh, not too long ago, and he did really, really, really well. So I'm hoping that we have the same luck tonight. Unfortunately, Nick is not with us, but that's okay. I've got Jordan and the pup, and we are gonna be out here grinding. So hopefully we can get some fish, and maybe we can even get a couple for the pan and do a little catch and cook video for you guys. So stay tuned. You're not going to want to miss out on the action. It's not going to take too long, and we are going to get hooked up on some walleye, so stay tuned. All righty, guys, so I just got my first tip up in. First line is wet. So now uh, we're going to go ahead and set up the other two. I'm fishing about six to eight inches off of bottom here. That's kind of that key area for the walleyes, especially late at night like we're fishing right now. So hopefully these fish start to push through. I'm gonna go ahead and get my other one set up. I've got a shiner on the first one and I think I'm gonna go probably sucker on the next one and maybe the other one after that. I, I really like suckers. Some guys love shiners. So I've got a little mixture of both tonight. So let's go ahead and get the other one set up. All right. What's up, buddy? Oh, hey, Nico. Uh, Say hi to the camera. This is our little buddy, Nico. There's Jordan. Put him on some fish tonight. Oh, yeah. What do you think? Do you think we can get him to catch one? All right, guys. So now that we've got all of our tip-ups in, we're going to go ahead and sit here in the truck. We are not far away from our tip-ups, which is really nice. So as soon as I see a light go up, it's game time, baby. So hopefully it won't take too long. We'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, guys, we just got our first flag. No movement quite yet. Jordan said she was moving just a little bit when he first walked up to it. I'm just gonna go for it, man. Easy, easy. Line's going down below me. I think I feel a middle tugging. Dropped it. There's the bobber. Took out a decent little line. Yeah, he did. Yeah, he dropped it. Middle's still there. Huh. All right, we're gonna get her back down and hopefully we get hooked up here soon. That did not take long at all. We sat here and waited and waited and waited for that first flag, and now we just had two within probably what five minutes, ten minutes of each other. Just went up. Maybe no movement. Tonight. Yeah, they do seem a little finicky. Well, we'll see if we get any movement on this bad boy. No movement at all, huh? Just that little Robert's bit. like straight down. Huh. Shh. Took out about four inches and dropped her. Sorry, Neeks. We'll get you <laughs> on the next flag. <laughs> Ladies and gents, we got the old grill a running. Got the old propane out. Jordan, what are you thinking? Well, you need to be eating good when you're out here pulling all nighters. That's right. Gotta be eating good. How's it looking? Looks all right. Ooh. Nice little Krabby Patty we got here. <laughs> oh, first bite. Look at the pink inside of that. Well, oh. could use a little longer cook time, but. <laughs> Not bad when you're out here starving, eh? It's pretty good. It was delicious, dude. Oh my God, dude. Flag. flag, 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 flag. Let's go, third flag of the night. Here we go, boys. No movement yet, no it's movement. Cold out here. Oh, 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 there here we is. go, here we go. Nico, sit. Holy. Sit. Dude, that thing's ripping. Come here, Nico. Oh my God, it's ripping, bro. It is ripping. Well, I know that ain't a minnow. <laughs> oh, no, that's definitely not the minnow. Wow. He Look was... at him peeling. Nico, sit. Pike will do that a lot, but. Hey, sit. 
Walleye typically oh don't boy, do that. Stay. Look how good he, oh yeah, he's well going. behaved he is. Let him run Dude. with it, sucker down. You're gonna be spooled in no Yank time. Him. Look at that thing just peeling. He's on there. He's coming with me though. Oh, there oh he is. Head oh. shakes. Here we go, boys. It doesn't seem too big. That's okay. It might be one that's ready for There's the pan. My button. Here he comes. Oh, here yeah. he comes. There we go. Woo! Good eater. What is that, Nico? Woo! What is that? Check that's it out. That's some gold, baby. We got gold on top of the ice. It's been a long time with no flag, but we just finally got another one. So I believe this is flag number five. We've got two fish so far, so that's not a bad sign. Well, how are we looking, Jordan? <laughs> there we go. Another nice eater. Get the old jaw spetters out. Oh yeah, he swallowed it good. Ooh, there we go. All right. That's number three. Give me some, Jordan. Let's Three go, more. buddy. Woo! Alrighty, everyone. Well, as you can tell, the sun is now coming up. It's a little bit brighter out. We ended up with three fish and all three of them were below the slot, well, in between that 15 to 20 range, which is exactly what we wanted. Unfortunately, the limit would have been six. We only came away with three keepers, but that's all right. And we didn't get on top of a giant, but honestly, I'm not gonna complain, guys. A Little bit of a slow night, to be honest with you. The fish seemed to be a little bit finicky, but as we were looking at the pressure, it was kind of expected for tonight. So overall, we did pretty well. Now it's time to head home and have these fish hit the frying pan. They're going to be so delicious. So we'll see you guys there. Now that we are back at the house, it is time to start making some dinner. Guys, I'm super excited to go ahead and fillet these fish. Tonight we are going to be using hot and spicy Cheez-Its. Now I don't know if this is a good idea, but my creativity has gotten the best of me. Last time I did a little catch and cook video, you guys may have seen I made some pan fish with Frosted Flake cereal and it was dynamite. It was actually some of the best fish I've ever had, if not the best fish I've ever had. So tonight we're gonna be using those Cheez-Its. I'm gonna use that as some breading. I'm basically just gonna crush them up really, really fine. And then I'm also going to be adding in some flour. I've got my first walleye on the cutting board here. I've got most of my ingredients all laid out. I'm gonna go ahead, start filleting this first fish. Now that I have my fillets all washed up, cleaned, and made sure that they are deboned, what I like to do is I like to take them and make them into a little bit smaller increments. So I'm gonna go ahead and basically just cut these into thirds right here. So now we're gonna go ahead, put some butter on these. As you can tell, I've got some spray butter here. All we're gonna do is lightly drizzle those in some butter. Oh yeah, I can already tell this is going to be delicious. I've got the pan on. We're gonna put some oil in here. Just a little 100% pure olive oil. You gotta love it. Now we're gonna take these, get that butter pushed all the way around those fillets. And we're gonna start dumping them into our flour and hot and spicy cheese it mix. So I'm gonna go ahead and dunk these in. This is gonna be awesome. I think this is gonna work really, really good. Pan starting to warm up a little bit here. Oh yeah, this is going to be delicious, guys. This is gonna be awesome. Look at that guys, they're coming along pretty well. They're just about ready for a flip. That cheesy breading is gonna be delicious. Time to go ahead and start putting them on the plate. Get ready for that first bite. Oh my gosh, that walleye just falls right apart. Oh man, I'm excited. Here we go guys. Holy cow, that's really good. Kind of spicy to be honest with you. Wow, those hot and spicy Cheez-Its and then a little Southwest Chipotle on top. This is really, really good guys. Highly recommend, try it out. Guys, we did it. We successfully walleye fished, filleted our fish and made them with some of the most outrageous stuff I've ever seen. <laughs> I don't know of anyone that's ever made uh, walleye and prepared it 
by using a Cheez-Its cracker breading. If you guys have, let me know down in the comments below because I'm actually curious to see what you guys have. So far, that are kind of out of the ordinary breading styles that I've used are Frosted Flakes and Cheez-Its, and both of them are dynamite. So I'm very, very curious to see what you guys have tried as well in the past. I've got multiple things that I'd like to do in the future just to try out and see which one I like the most. If you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to leave a thumbs up on it, guys. It's greatly, greatly appreciated. If you guys have any questions or concerns as to how we did our fishing, any techniques, uh, any techniques as far as anything I may have missed in the cooking process, uh, if you guys have questions, just leave all of that stuff down below. So. Thank you guys again so much for joining us today. If you guys are new to the channel and you guys wanna see more of these types of videos, make sure to subscribe. We're gonna be doing a lot more ice fishing now that ice is here in Northern Wisconsin. So I'm gonna go ahead, finish my meal. Thank you guys again so much for joining me. Before you guys go, make sure to check out our Instagram page as well. We've got new stuff uploading up there all the time that's gonna give you a little preview as to what we're gonna be uploading on the channel and when it's coming. So go ahead, check it out, nb.edits on Instagram. We'll see you guys on the next one. Tight lines from NB Edits.